the more I see of your boss, the more I like him. If I was you, I wouldn't be so critical of who others associate with. So is he gonna be... Really? Is he gonna be a problem? For sure. Don't! But there's nothing we can do about it. If something happened to him right now, I'd be right under a microscope. An electron microscope of bureaucratic shit. And that would make it very difficult to keep old secrets. Oh, well, boo-hoo. Stop! Well, boo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo -hoo for you. You know who else is having trouble keeping secrets, asshole? Me. After you brought Trevor in on this. I only brought him in after you put out your press release. Townley's taking scores again. The Los Santos reboot. If we didn't control the situation and he'd unearth this connection, then what? Then Trevor flips out, beheads me, kills my family, or raises them as his own. I don't know which is worse. Anyway, any of that could happen at any time. Slow down. Let's think this through. What does he know? He knows I'm alive. He knows I got money. And now he knows I'm working with the FIB. Does he know how long you've been working with the FIB? You've been working with the FIB? How long? The fuck does that matter? Either you were working with us before the cash depot job, you walked your crew into an ambush, one of them spent ten years on the run, and the other landed in a federal penitentiary. Or... Or... We stopped. No more car accidents. We stumbled on the cash depot job. Brad went down, you went down. Trevor got away. The FIB cut you a deal on your sickbed, faked your death, and you end up here. Who's to say which of those is true? That there's any doubt probably accounts for you being alive. Back there, Trevor made you right away. The second he saw you. You remember after the bust, I was in all the papers. I was on the evening news. The man who killed Michael Townley. Yeah, I was quite a trophy. A good head to hang on your wall. Back then, sure. Not now. Place. Davy, they've been shooting the real cunts of suburbia here the last few weeks. No way that's your guy. Shit. You are kidding me. I'll call Steve. Wrong house. This guy isn't our guy. Okay, okay, okay. You sure you don't silence him just to make sure? If we're silencing someone, we're silencing the right someone. Get me another address. Hey, you want a coffee? Turns out that was the wrong Azerbaijani. We need a new address from Mr. K. Choose your instrument and go to work on it. Where do we start, eh, buddy? Uh, wait. What are you talking about, the wrong guy? No. Who do you want? Just tell me what you want. Huh, man? Huh, please. Look at me, please. Tell me where to start. Uh, are any of those teeth less useful than the others? Let me find it! Please don't! I just have the blazer! Wait a minute. 
make a man talk is to stop him being able to talk. That hurt too much. <laughs> Mr. Phillips, ask him about Tahir Javan. What did you ask me? I know it's here. I did his home theater. <laughs> he lives in too much. The right on the Western Highway. Well, that wasn't so tough, was it? Uh -huh. <laughs> Did you get that? Did you hear him? Lives in Chumash, the Western Highway. Chumash, you're driving. Remember, terror does not take coffee breaks. <sighs> what a dick. <laughs> So how are Steve and Trevor getting along? Seems like a productive relationship. You know, like I said, he's got... This was a nice car! Like I said, he's got his uses. And as you can see, we're trying to take full advantage of him. Then what? This thing with the agency is put to rest and we don't need you anymore. Right. And what about Trevor? What about him? I need some resolution, Davey. You let him walk. You said you'd clean the whole thing up back in North Yankton. And you told me it'd be a clean job, no casualties. There were more eyes on that town than they needed. Yeah, well... Right. Well, you don't see me driving! According to my eyes, Trevor's your problem, Dave, as much as he is mine. He's not a problem at all. We're monitoring him. Has he said anything about Brad? Fuck yeah, he has. Plenty. I keep changing the subject. You know, he thinks you might actually commute Brad's sentence when this is all over. That's good. Fine work. We'll send another one. It's about time anyway. Oh, so that's you who's been sending those fucking letters to Trevor, huh? Yeah. He thinks they're from Brad. Who he thinks is locked up in high security and not, well, not six feet under in a grave marked Michael Townley. The trainee's right, and it's a good exercise. Yeah, the fuck. How'd that get started? A few years ago, a letter came to the federal prison system addressed to Brad. This'll do. All right. Find out who we're looking for. Yeah, we need a description of the target. Yeah, uh, I'll take care of it. Loosen him up. No, no, please. I tell what? you what Loosen you him up. No, no, please. Break him, Mr. Phillips. He, he's on my life later, man. I will drown. I will. Torturer! Say this! I got blood in my mouth! My mouth! I, I will drown! I will drown! Torturer! <laughs> Done the trick. We're gonna get him out of the The black is terrible. It was all a dream. It's a nightmare. Hey, 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 hey. Now, huh? Now you ready to talk? I've been ready to talk fucking since the day I got given the That's what ago. we were afraid of. So, so, yeah, yeah, yeah. Talk. This guy we're after. What does he look like? I was built. What? I was high, middle age. Yeah, yeah, it sounds like you're stalling. This better be enough. Middle age, middle height, middle build, whatever. He's dark, okay? He's Azerbaijani, for God's sakes. Look around. That enough for you? You're my eyes, Townley. What do you see? I see a couple guys that are way too old and too fat to be doing a political assassination. Let's keep it objective, okay? What's in the scope? When I need analysis, I'll call a pundit. There's a party, all right? We need eyes in the room. We're live. You see anyone down there who might be an Azerbaijani? Fuck do I know. You might be an Azerbaijani for all I know. 
What's one look like? They look eastern. Half this town looks eastern, Davey. You got the fall of the Shah and the collapse of communism to thank for that. Anyone stand out? No, they all kind of blend in. Make a call, Dave. We're gonna need some more info on this guy. They're having a party down there. <sighs> that ain't gonna cut it, my friend. Shit, shit. I, let me think. I remember. Ah! Oh, Sorry, too God. late, Trevor. Show our contestant what he's won today. I remember. Oh, okay. wait, wait, wait. I remember. Woo! We gotta break him down to build him up. Time out! Huh? T O! Come on! Oh, 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 oh! Knee shot! <laughs> So what have you got for us? Hmm? We need Trev to shake up your memory again? No, 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 who am I looking for? Steve saying beard. What do you got? Anything specific, or is some stubble going to cut it? Let's start at Mountain Men, and we'll work our way down until someone fits the profile. Well, there's a few beards at this party. Vinewood's full of... What the hell? That was the guy. I had a feeling. You get kicks out of killing innocent women now? The report I'm gonna have to write. Stevie fucked it. Beards are in fashion in Chumash. Land of beach hipsters, we need more. It's gonna be a long day until you give us some intel on our target. Oh, he's, he's, he's got beer. He smokes. He smokes like a fucking chimney. I don't know. Trev, maybe one more time? Just to be sure. No, please, no. Huh? I told you, he smokes. That's all I know. Do him. I'm a completist. Beer, left hand, smoker, that's it. Take another two, please! I will die! My heart! He's cooked! Quit it! Don't fry him! Did you, you see his face when I did that? <laughs> Mr. K. Mr. K. I don't know anything, please. Okay. He chain smokes. And he's left handed. What's that? He chain smokes. And he's left handed. Ah, okay. Any of these bearded guys at the party smoke cigarettes? Mr. K says he smokes like a pack of two a day. Redwood cigarettes? Thank you, Mr. K. Steve's telling me he chain smokes redwoods. It ain't the cigarettes that'll kill him. It's the guys who put the warnings on the packets you should worry about. And he's left-handed. Oh, now I get it. You're telling me to assassinate a guy because he's got facial hair, a cigarette, and he's left-handed. Ah, I see someone. He fits the profile. What the hell? That was the guy. I had a feeling. It'll check out. Well, we've got him. It's done. Woo! That is a wrap, my friends. Excellent work to the pair of you. Now, I got a racquetball game to get to, so Trevor, if you take care of Mr. K, I think we're all set. What the <laughs> fuck do you want me to do with him? I would say he's outlived his usefulness. Oh, oh come on, please. Shut up! That's a sport. <coughs> Let's go, come on. Wait a second, Mr. Wolf. Fuck, let's just go, okay? I ain't gonna let those G-Man fucking scumbags tell me what to do. Oh, what? You just tortured me. Don't ask too many fucking questions. Let's go. Get up. 
Come on, up the fucking stairs. Oh, for fuck's sakes. Come on, let's go. All right, now you got a flight to catch, okay? Let's get you to the air. Oh, safety first. Hey, how's your mouth? It hurts. Can you speak? Kinda. Are you gonna hold it together? I want to go home. I want to see my family. No, 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 no. You have no home. You have no family. That shit is over. I do. They're in the morning wood. I love them very much. No, that's your old life. That's over now. You're off the grid. You're one of the invisible people. Just take me home. I'm taking you to the airport. You're gonna get on a plane. You're flying a long way from this country, and you're gonna spread your message. I don't have a message! You're a torture advocate! Advocate? The media and the government would have us believe that torture is some necessary thing. We need it to get information, to assert ourselves. Did we get any information out of you? I would have told you everything! Exactly! Tortures for the torturer, or the guy giving the order to the torturer. You torture for the good times. We should all admit that. It's useless as a means of getting information. I'm feeling lightheaded. Sometimes you torture for the torturee, but only if they're prepared to pay. I am very unwell. It's me, 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 me with you. Jesus Christ, good. I thought we really bonded, but now I'm having my doubts. No one drives me to the airport. Run, you're free. Oh, what? But my family is here. Your family is probably the ones who got you fucking in here, all right? And look, trust no one, all right? You're alone now. Really? Yeah, really, now let's go. Fuck off. Come on.
There's a hostile. Step on the gas. You're getting robbed! Uh. You say right. I say become a doctor. You say become a patient. I say, who is that? Hello, Missy. Wow, Franklin. You never told me that you had a sister. I'm Denise, Franklin's housemate. And aunt, my mother's old dried up ass Shut sister. the fuck up. Yeah, shut the fuck up. Here, darling. Why don't you go get yourself something nice, okay? <laughs> You. <laughs> is, is it seven dollars? I said something nice, not expensive. You want to be a greedy fucking cow, huh? No. Now get the fuck out of here, all right? You men are all the same. Man, what the fuck you doing here? Here with the boy, the boys. What? I'm fucking new in town. I'm making friends, all right? Now let's party. Look, I had plans on getting some rest until this clown and my aunt came and fucked that up. My nigga, I just came over here to holler at you about the little thing. Man, I said I'm tired, dawg. What fucking thing? I love things. I'm the king of things. I ain't talking to you, homie. Hey, let's go do something about the thing, okay? What thing? I'm talking about the little stress thing, man. Fucking beautiful. Perfect. It's a gangbang. Let's go. Come on. <sighs> come on Who is this man? Man, what is nigga man, just come on. Where's this thing happening? Down Grove Street. We shooting shit up, spraying some motherfuckers. I can drive by with the best of them. Behave yourself, man. Lamar, what's happening? What you in stress set up? You buying weight, homie. Something that'll move us up the food chain, nigga, for real. Not this real in this town, nigga. Particularly where you in stress concern. Man, this is an investment. Give your passengers some warning, eh? This is an investment opportunity. You got to speculate to accumulate. Ooh, first rule of business. Hey, since we're out here banging, either you got some dust. Fool wanna get butt naked? <laughs> I'll get whatever it takes me, homeboy. Homie live up here. Hey, look, everybody be cool, man. Lamar about to do his thing, all right? Come on, Franklin! Hey, be on point. This fool janky. Courier service. Packets to collect. You got the grip? Present and accounted for. 
You like that, huh? Sample? <laughs> now we talking. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 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 My throat getting numb already. So we good, nigga, right? Mm -hmm. Well, let's go. How about a taste? No, man, we leaving. I want a taste of the other side of the brick. Now, you heard what your boy said, you're leaving. Hey, give me, give me the... Give me the... Back. Whoa. What the fuck? Did we ask for a key or a fucking ounce? Man, that's motherfucking drywall. Hey, we got some motherfucking buyer's remorse out here. You can't fucking hustle a hustler! Fuck off! Ah. Oh, you motherfuckers are dead! Roll free like that! We got... Boom! Goddamn, man, fuck!
Stop right there, dog. Hold up, hold up. And jack they ass, homie. That's our way up out of here. Get the C sharp. Put your fucking hands up. of a gangbanger.
me! Outside your house! Jesus! Ah! 
Would you open Fine. your fucking eyes? Trevor is a, the Trevor. Trevor is a. Trevor is a what? Trevor is a good guy. He got family. And got kid. Any boy? That, 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 that's it, right? Yes, Trevor. <laughs> but, but the thing is, um, I ain't been with that many women. I don't find it easy. And um, and Deborah, I mean, we're getting married, so. Oh, that's beautiful. But I'm scared that she's gonna leave me. I mean, this is her place, and the fornicating. There was Mr. Raspberry Jam. Whoa, whoa! Now, Mr. Raspberry Jam, he died a noble death, bringing great joy to a lonely man. I ain't got a very big penis. 
Some girls laugh when they, when they look at it. Oh, show me. Show me, okay. boy! I, 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 I don't want to. <sighs> Mine ain't nothing special, but this boy gets the job done. All right? Now, Wade here says that you work at the docks. Uh, yes. Look at me! Can you just put your Johnson away, sir? Oh, Jesus. Yes, I work at the docks. And? Anything uh, interesting there for a man like me? Well, I mean, I, I, I don't rightly, rightly know. What kind of person are you? Oh, I'm that kind of person, Floyd. I am that kind of person. Now, let's get you, Wade, and that little tormentor down there to put these on. We are going for a ride. Gentlemen, the gateway to America awaits. Run, we got an inside man at the port of LS. I'm gonna send you some information. I need you on point to help plan things. I got it, T. I really miss it. You know where the port is? Come on then, Floyd, what you got for me? Like I said, I don't rightly know what we got. Uh, you're going to have to be more exact in your questioning, sir. Uh, we're looking for something to steal. Sir, I stole a pencil in elementary school, and I've been regretting it ever since. Floyd always was a stick in the mud. Look, sir, please, just tell me what you want, and I'll do my utmost to assist you in finding it. Here's the problem. I don't know what I want. It's a bit, well... Okay. Well, like pornography or a perfect turd. I can't quite describe it. I'll know it when I see it. You ain't aiding my comprehension. All right, all right. Well, how's this? 230... And 36 billion dollars worth of cargo came through the port of Los Santos last year. He's real good with numbers. I don't want to hijack a truck full of pineapples, Floyd. You need to give us the inside track on what's coming through. We don't know what's in the containers. They certainly don't put price tags on them. Have you noticed anything? Anything different? Anything that might indicate something? Well, there's been all these uh, Merryweather folks hanging around. Merryweather Security Consultant. Hey, Neil. Merryweather Security Consultant. Private Army to the New World Order. My butt's gone The folks up. waging outsourced shadow wars in 20 countries around the world have been recently cleared to operate on U.S. soil. That, um, sounds like them. So there's a private militia in the port. What are they guarding? This one freighter? I guess now that you mention it, it ain't quite right. Freighter. Perfect. Can I get on board? No, no. They won't let anywhere near it. They're kind of assholes about it, actually. The other day, my colleague Ralph. I don't give a shit about Ralph. We gotta take a look. Is there anything else? There's another bunch of Merryweather guys out by the Navy warehouse. They got boats coming in and out. I heard they was testing something. All right, we'll take a look at that as well. Ain't 
Come and work! Yeah? Once you're off them, you're straight on the highway. A truck can come here, load up, and get on the blacktop, keep on going till he runs out of gas. Real poetic. What happens if an alarm's tripped? The National Office of Security Enforcement monitors the whole area. If something goes off in Port City, every road round here gets shut down. Go park and get the dispatch. Uh, yep, will do. <laughs> Go park and get the dispatch! Here comes the suit. I gotta check in. Remember, Floyd, this can go real wrong real quick. He's always drunk. Well, he's particularly drunk, okay? We got a waste spillage and I got a slot on the cleanup crew. There is nothing that Wade here ain't gonna do for a warm meal. You got a strong stomach, son. Get in there. You gonna take me to see this freighter? Yeah, it's over here. What? He started getting weird. You ever get helicopters coming in and out of here? You know, those big sky crane things that could pick up a whole container? Now, this is restricted airspace. They won't let anything out of here without clearance. Shoot it down if they have to. So how's a man in a hurry supposed to get in and out of this place? Well, we got a port that stretched to 50 feet. Now, what's the Coast Guard response like? Well, they got cutters, 45-foot response vessels, air support. You're not gonna move much faster than them, especially if you're carrying something. Maybe I'll have to saddle you up and ride you across the Miriam Turner overpass. You can do something about these assholes. They ain't part of nothing. Government I just said they have the water surface real covered. Okay. Now that is the freighter I told you about. Over there, two o'clock. Looks like Forrest got on the wrong side of some Merryweather guys. What do you think they got on it? We just Steven Dora. We ain't meant to know what's in the containers. But? But these are marked military. Government. Anything weird about that? The government stuff is hot freight. Pulls up, goes right through. This stuff's just been sitting here. You are beginning to arouse my curiosity. On the handler. A couple of containers and baby gotta be brought up to F. That ain't a question. Get on it. Now. I'm gonna tell you when you're done. Show some respect for government workers. Get up. We gotta do this. I guess I gotta pretend I'm a dock worker if I wanna stay. How about I run that prick over in this thing? I thought you wanted to scope the place. We don't get the containers. They're gonna check your card. Oh, I'm getting nervous. You're always nervous. Relax. Not always, sir. Just around you. And it's just uh, Cousin Wade's on his own. He better hold it together. Stick to the story. He'll be fine. Boy's on a waste clearance crew. He's never happier when he's neck deep in shit. Those are the containers in Bay B.
Trevor! We gotta bring it over to Bay F. I know why they call them handlers, because they handle like a dream. This ain't a toy, sir. It's heavy machinery. Thank fuck I'm high as a kite. You should not be operating this vehicle while under the influence. I'll operate you under the influence if you're not careful. I'm going to lose my job! There it is. Now I guess we got to get the other one. I'm gonna need a better view of that freighter. I'm sorry, but this is as close as you going to get. Nah, nah, nah. I need to take some pictures. Send them to my guy, Ron. I'll need a proper view. There's the cranes, but... Cranes! Perfect! Oh, shoot. Be careful. Look it up! Hey, whose dick you have to suck to get this job? Being a stevedore used to be back-breaking work. Now you're paid brain surgeon bucks to push an oversized shopping cart. I did not fellatiate no one to get this job. Deborah's old friends with the... Well, with the... With the... With the say no more! You didn't fellate no one, but darling Debbie probably did. She probably enjoyed it. Check us! How about I run that prick over in this thing? I thought you wanted to scope the place. We don't get the containers, they're gonna check your cart. Oh, I'm getting nervous. You're always nervous. Relax. Not always, sir. Just around you. And it's just a cousin Wade's on his own. You better hold it together. Stick to the story. You'll be fine. Boys on a waste clearance crew. It's those containers. Baby. Okay, we got it. Let's take her down to Bay M. I know why they call them handlers, because they handle like a dream. This ain't a toy, sir. It's heavy machinery. Thank fuck I'm high as a kite. You should not be operating this vehicle while under the influence. I'll operate you under the influence if you're not careful.
How about I run that prick over in this thing? I thought you wanted to scope the place. We don't get the containers. They're gonna check your card. Oh, I'm getting nervous. You're always nervous. Relax. Not always, sir. Just around you. And it's just that Cousin Wade's on his own. He better hold it together. Stick to the story. You'll be fine. Boys on a waste clearance crew. Those are the containers in Bay B. Clamp it on now. That's it. Now we gotta bring it over to Bay F. I know why they call them handlers, because they handle like a dream. This ain't a toy, sir. It's heavy machinery. Thank fuck I'm high as a kite. You should not be operating this vehicle while under the influence. I'll operate you under the influence if you're not careful. How about I run that prick over in this thing? I thought you wanted to scope the place. We don't get the containers. They're going to check your card. Oh, I'm getting nervous. You're always nervous. Relax. Not always, sir. Just around you. And it's just uh, Cousin Wade's on his own. He better hold it together. Stick to the story. He'll be fine. Boys on a waste clearance crew. It's those containers, baby. Hook it up. Okay, we got it. Let's take her down to Bay F. I know why they call them handlers, because they handle like a dream. This ain't a toy, sir. It's heavy machinery. Thank fuck I'm high as a kite. You should not be operating this vehicle while under the influence. I'll operate you under the influence if you're not careful. How about I run that prick over in this thing? I thought you wanted to scope the place. We don't get the containers. They're gonna check your card. Oh, I'm getting nervous. You're always nervous. Relax. Not always, sir. Just around you. And it's just uh, Cousin Wade's on his own. He better hold it together. Stick to the story. He'll be fine. Boy's on a waste clearance crew. He's never happier when he's neck deep in shit. Those are the containers in Bay B. And attach it. That's it. Now we got to bring it over to Bay F. I know why they call them handlers, because they handle like a dream. This ain't a toy, sir. It's heavy machinery. Thank fuck I'm high as a kite. You should not be operating this vehicle while under the influence. I'll operate you under the influence if you're not careful. There it is. Now I guess we gotta get the other one. I'm gonna need a better view of that freighter. I'm sorry, but this is as close as you are going to get. Nah, 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 I need to take some pictures. Send them to my guy, Ron. I'll need a proper view. There's the cranes, but... Cranes! Perfect! Oh, shoot.
Never! Clamp it on now! Hey, whose dick you have to suck to get this job? Being a stevedore used to be back-breaking work. Now you're paid brain surgeon bucks to push an oversized shopping cart. I did not fellatiate no one to get this job. Deborah's old friends with the... Well, with the... With the... With the say no more! You didn't fellate no one, but darling Debbie probably did. She probably enjoyed it. Okay, it's up to the top of the crane for me. There ain't time to admire the view. I've been waiting on a crane driver nearly an hour. I'm not permitted to drive cranes, buddy. Hey, you need me to get your union rep up here right now? Sooner you get in the cab, sooner we can get out of here. This is on you. Come up onto this catwalk, then go down the ladder and into the cabin. Ah! There ain't time to admire the view. I've been waiting on a crane driver nearly an hour. I'm not permitted to drive cranes, buddy. Hey, you need me to get your union rep up here right now? Sooner you get in the cab, sooner we can get out of here. This is on you. Get up on this walkway, climb down the ladder, and go into the cabin. Okay, I'm sitting here. What do you want? Pick up the red containers down at this end and put them on the trucks at the other end. First, you gotta line up the cabin over the container. There's some lights on the spreader that should help with alignment. Looks like you're in line. You got it. Now pick it up so it'll clear the other containers and move it down to the end. Take us to the other end, bay number five. We ain't there yet.
There's the truck. Set it down gentle. Bring the container down over the truck's frame. working together. Now let's do the same thing again. Get back down to the other end. Get in position over the second container in bay one. You're done. Break time. How about this view, huh? I'm gonna take some photos for the kids.
take you over to the warehouse. This rig ain't being used. It's on the other side of Port City. So they've been guarding one of them dry docks. We can take a look at it, but no one's allowed around there. Normal rules don't apply to us, Floyd. We're going in. I don't know. The rules applied to me my whole life. I like rules. And look at you. You're a failure. You're in a loveless relationship. What do you mean? Loveless? I love Deborah. If she loved you, she'd be here, wouldn't she? But she's not. Uh, you know I'm insecure. You've got a dead-end job. What? Dead end? No. Floyd, it's dead end. Being a unionized longshoreman is one of the best paying jobs in the country. You tell people around La Puerta that's what you do, they're liable to rob you. Oh, they're liable to rob you. I'm so jealous. No one's jealous of you, Floyd. They pity you. You're abused by that woman. You're abused by these slave drivers. I mean, I've never worked so hard in my life. It ain't so bad. Uh, I've been doing this every day for 10 years, only usually with less of the criminality. You're wasting your life, Floyd. It's lucky we turned up when we did. I'm saving you from yourself. We ain't heard from Wade. What are you, his mother? He's fine. The spillage shouldn't take this long to contain. There must be a lot of it. Good. Keep him busy while we get to work. No entiendo! No understand you! Huh? Manifesto! Manifesto say deliver here! Mm. Hey, stop! Where the fuck Get do you think you're going? Get back must have got confused. Uh, God don't speak English. Uh, must have read the manifesto. manifesto. <laughs> he said, <laughs> he said, no, here! Trevor, these photos, you've really stumbled onto something. The ship, Merriweather. Yeah, 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 I know. Tell me about the ship. If we put a man with a gun on the bridge next to it and get a guy on board, I think we got a good chance of taking over. 
Way it looks to me, there's a container below deck. They're guarding it for the government, keeping it off the books. Serious military technology, most like. Yeah, of course. I just found a manifest. They're testing something out at sea. It's gotta be that. Now, get back to work. The TPI conglomerate ain't thriving. There's only one man responsible. Of course, yeah. But I'll start pulling all the intel I can get on Merriweather at the same time. I, I got a file here somewhere.
sakes. Cover me, Mareros! <laughs> what in the name of all things holy? I, I, I tried to stop it, but it just kept coming and coming. Oh, it's, they're there, Wade. Look, 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 it's a, Betty, you're just not cut out for honest work, all right? <laughs> Did you get what you needed? Yeah, 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 more or less. Yeah, I just got to uh, figure out a place to plan this now. All right, this will do. Huh? That woman ain't even fine. Ain't no one understands why Floyd lets her use him so. Oh, that's uh, low self-esteem, Wade. We got to build him back up. Now. Mm. Mm. And there, perfect. All right, so based on my observations, I'd say these Merryweather security cock snots are sitting on something real valuable. I think they got two of these things, but we only need one. First one is on that freighter in a container below deck. They got guards all over that ship, so it's likely they're keeping it on ice. The air, land, and sea routes into the port will be locked down as soon as we make a noise at these X's here. Which means we have to blow up the ship and grab the thing underwater. Need a guy to plant the bombs, a guy to look out for him with a rifle, and a guy to grab the thing, whatever it is, underwater. That means stealing us a submarine, of course, but you can find us one of them, can't you? Huh? Now, the other one is off the coast being tested. They're running the operation from the dock where I last saw your cousin. We'll need a submarine for that, too, and probably a chopper, a big one. We go out there, look around underwater, locate it, bring it back here, and find out what it is. Here? To the Congo? Aight, so, what do you think? Container ship or whatever's offshore?
offshore. Deep sea adventure, gotta be. You and Floyd can help, and we'll bring along Michael and his unpaid intern. You okay, all right. What is that smell? Oh, we are going straight to the local union rep. Yep. Wade here was injured in the performance of his duties. Human waste has seeped into his very pores, and I am sorry to say this, but I don't think he's ever gonna smell normal again. <laughs> you can't go to the union. You are union, all right? And you vouched for us, all right? You look at him, man. Smell him, no. smell him. <laughs> Trevor, Trevor, I, you're, you're planning a robbery on my place of work. You violated Mr. Raspberry Jam, and God alone knows what else. You damaged Deborah. Look, my lady and my union, that's all I got. So why don't we just, uh, why don't we just let this all slide, huh? If you're comfortable with what's happened to your cousin, then so be it, all right? But I would give him a bath and rinse him off. No! No bath! Ah, Trevor. Hey, Mikey. Hey, listen. Don't be a dick, bro. I'm trying to look out for you. Just give me the key. Whatever, Dad. I'm totally fine. Just had a couple of beers. What are you talking about? We had like six shots each. Look at you. Will you two just make out already? Hey, can you give me a ride? Just so Boy Scout there can get his buzzkill badge. There's my car. Where we go? I'm on Alta Place. Off, uh, Howick Ave. It's not that far. Oh, I don't feel so good. <sighs> I just got a mouthful of, of something. You better take it slow. Hey, thanks for this, man. As you can see, I could have driven. No problem, but Joy Killer back there had to lay a guilt trip on me. I believe they wanted me to walk. Walk. Ugh. Look out! Do you believe they wanted me to walk? Walk. I don't know you think this is Europe. Just because I sound drunk doesn't mean my brain's drunk. You know, it's offensive. You don't call a deaf kid. Well, take it easy. Annoying. You don't call a deaf kid stupid for talking funny. I me hurl! Oh shit. Uh, uh, I'm, I'm gonna bark. Oh, that's it, little man. Sing me a rainbow. Oh. 
<laughs> Dude, sorry about that. Uh, most of it went out the window. I'll, I'll throw some cash your way. Now, try that again without slurring. Whoa! Whoa. Yeah, I feel much better. That tactical vomit really sorted me out. Starving now. Oh, yes! I still got some cluck and bell at home from last night. I am all over that! I tell you, the planets are aligned, bro. Karma is sucking my boy right now. You can always try shutting up. See how that feels. Thanks for the ride, man. Sorry for blowing chunks. Take this toward the cleaning. I'll see you around. Try not to pass out and choke on your sick. Tracy, baby, you called? Yeah, look, Dad, we're worried. I'm worried, too. I really want to see you. Well, I don't want to see you. You need help, like serious, serious help. And if you don't get it, you're going to be killed. Tracy, I love you. But you don't know what the fuck you're talking about. I tried, Daddy. That's all I could do.
Look at my eyes, nigga. You think I'm fucking with you old bitch ass niggas? Nigga, the only thing you fucking with is too much X, nigga. Now get the fuck on. Y'all niggas some bitches. You're dead, bitch. Fucked Ass up liquor. right there. Oh. I done a five-year uh. bid. I don't give ah. a shit. Ha. Uh. You're a fucking weak fool. Uh. Oh. I ain't new to the game, you feel me?
What's up, man? Sit down and... Young cats is crazy. My new website covers all three of us.
need backup now. All nearby units report immediately. What are you doing? I need backup now. All oh, nearby you. It's done. I know. Good work. All right. Well, shit. Let me know about the next thing. Will do. Uh, but before that, I've got to tell you something. Our investment portfolio is getting a little, uh, successful. So I figured we needed some tangible assets and uh, property. So we bought a house in the Vinewood Hills. Yeah, sure, man. Whatever. You know best about this shit. And we needed someone to live there you know, for tax purposes. So some guys are moving your stuff in. Oh, shit. Meaning I don't have to live with my crazy ass aunt no more? Man, I don't know what the fuck to say, dawg. Don't say anything, especially if a man in a suit comes to the door. Ah, I'm joking, that probably isn't gonna happen. It's yours, enjoy it. 3671 Wispy Mound Drive.
조심해. I don't care. Okay, you know Redwood cigarettes? Sure, the cigarette that built America. They've rigged a jury to throw a class action lawsuit that would cover the treatment costs of thousands of emphysema sufferers. There are four corrupt jurors on Redwood's books. I'll send you the details. Oh, and we only have a few hours to make them disappear. The court case is tomorrow morning. Is that all, dog? Shit, that's quite a favor. And that's quite a house you're living in. Get this done quickly, and I'll try to throw in a sweetener as well. Now, I'd advise picking up some long-range hardware to get this job done. You'll be helping a lot of people with this, Franklin, including anyone who might have a sizable investment in, say, uh, debonair cigarettes. Maricón.
Damn, I ain't got much time left. Appreciate this shit. What do you want from me? Not the car, man! Damn! Okay, that ought to do it. Hey, L, it's done, homie. All of them. Very good. I'll be in touch. 